Well, look at this place. It's ripped out. From those storms. Uh, check this out. The Laginas and their partners have invited metal detection expert Gary Drayton back to Oak Island. Because the harsh winter storms caused several areas of the island to suffer significant erosion, it is hoped that Gary will be able to turn up a number of interesting artifacts. Artifacts which may provide important clues that will help solve the Oak Island mystery. What I'm trying to do is detect where no one else has detected before. Okay. Today, they will begin their search at the area on Oak Island known as Isaac's Point, located on the easternmost part of the island. With over 25 years of experience as a professional treasure hunter, Gary Drayton has recovered more than a million dollars worth of surface artifacts and treasure during the course of his career. His past collaborations with the Oak Island team have yielded a number of significant discoveries. That is old, it's an handmade spike. Last year, he uncovered a large metal spike that he believes could have been used in the construction of a 16th century Spanish galleon. He also discovered a gold-plated 18th century British military button. I think it says plated. If it says plated, it's a button. That doesn't sound bad. That's a deep piece. I think we should dig it. OK. If I was guessing, I'd say it's like an... Here it is. It's iron. Big chunk of iron. Dang. What Ooh. Is that? That's not bad. What is it? It's a, like an old axe. Hmm. Wow. I think that's like a double woodcutter's axe. That's pretty cool. It is. It's probably early 1900s, yeah. unless it's a Viking axe, and then we're making headlines. I don't think it is. No. OK, mate, let's have a little scan, just see if there's any other targets. That sounds good. You said there's one here? That sounds really good. That's like a coin or a button type signal. Ooh, coin! Wow. While exploring the storm affected areas of Isaac's Point, metal detection expert Gary Drayton has just uncovered a potentially important find. Is it a coin or a button? I think that is a freaking coin. Looks like it. Very irregular shaped. Yeah, which is good. That means it could be old. So where do you think this is? I think that's old. I think we're in the 1700s. 1700s? Good find, for sure. Although old coins are frequently found on Oak Island, finding one from the 18th century could be a significant event. Prior to 1795, the year the original money pit was first discovered, Oak Island was virtually uninhabited, and evidence of human activity was scarce. If the coin in Peter Fernetti's hand can be dated to sometime before the late 1700s, it might actually have been left there by someone who either buried treasure on the island or someone who came there trying to find it. Copper or bronze? Yep, copper. Copper, for sure? Yep. I see designs on it. On this side here, look at all that design. These lines right here? Yeah. That's either an English or a French coin, my guess. It should clean up enough to get just a, even a little design off it yeah, so they can, so date, can date, it. date it. Sweet. Brilliant. It's a good find. High five, mate. <laughs>